Okay guys, if you don't want to go through those, um, how many minutes? Like 11 minutes of video, just listen to me quickly. I'm gonna leave the, un, in the description of this video two links for my podcast. If you use, or you, yeah, if you use uh, Spotify, uh, the first link would be enough. And uh, the second link is just in case, uh, just in case you don't have the app or you don't want to download it. The, the, the podcast is cool. Hopefully you guys like it. And um, that's it. If you want to watch the rest of the video, that's up to you. Might be interesting though. Okay, guys. Um, welcome to this YouTube channel. Or welcome myself to this YouTube channel. It's been a long time since I since I uploaded uploaded my last video. I think months now. Um, so if you were wondering what happened to me, I'm still alive, older definitely, but still alive, and I've been practicing English every single day, uh, and I've been trying to improve as much as I can. So. That's good, that's covered. <laughs> um, but the reason why I decided to make this video is not precisely related to uh, languages. Um, so uh, I wanted to make this video because I wanted to share my podcast with you. I have a podcast and actually I have had it for at least more than a year but I haven't really shared this podcast with many people. And uh, I wanted to tell you a little bit about this podcast because it might be interesting to you. And also, once more, as I always say, this is a good way for me to practice so English. So if you want to help me or you just think that my English needs to be corrected, please, just uh, send me your feed feedback or your corrections. They are all welcome. And I will be more than happy to get your corrections and to improve my English. Uh, so without further ado, here's the story of my podcast. Um, so first of all, like I said, I have this, I've, I've, I've had this podcast for more than a year. Actually, it is on Spotify. I know it sounds a little bit strange, but it is. And uh, like probably like two years ago, my brother and I started uh, having, or we, we, we were talking about the idea of recording our conversations because uh, we talk a lot, like we talk about our memories, our childhoods or childhood all, we have a lot of memories and the reason why we do this it's because I feel that um, our childhood was unique was different uh, than many many kids and not like super special or anything just a little bit different because our parents are missionaries so since I remember uh, uh, my parents are missionaries so when they got my brother and me they were already already missionaries meaning that um, our lives weren't going to be you know as normal as other kids um and yeah so we never went abroad like all the missions my parents got were around mexico especially in the southern uh Part or southern Mexico uh, we lived in other uh, parts like in central Mexico and some parts of northern Mexico but mainly we were in the south uh, the, the interesting thing is that even though you might say huh well the south is just the south so everybody is and looks and talks the same you know you just if you don't live and if you don't, you know, like move around this, uh, like an area, even if you're not talking about like long distances, uh, you know, people is different in different parts of the world. 
And so uh, I'm talking about Mexico, by the way. So um, uh, as far as I remember, or all I can remember is that, you know, every year or every two years max, we would move to a different place. And that meant a lot of things. <laughs> but um, so this unique way of living uh, nowadays when I talk to my brother or since I started talking with my brother about these memories, um, I don't know, we just thought that they were unique and we wanted to keep him, you know, like to save him for, I don't know, for our, our own children or our own uh, or ourselves, you know. Um, so uh, now that we don't live together anymore, we've been talking on the phone or using video calls and at some point he was like why don't you make a podcast with our memories and i was like huh that's not a bad idea and i literally got us a podcast uh but it wasn't meant to be really used to share with anybody or like to uh, my idea or my goal was okay once i have a podcast i'm just gonna make the episodes and i'm just gonna save in there as a you know as a gift to myself or my family at some point but literally my only goal was to have these conversations with my brother for when i can't walk anymore when i'm really old and um I don't know, I just pictured myself being really old, not able to walk anymore or a little bit sick. I don't know, just, I guess, <laughs> pretty negative ideas. But I was just thinking, yeah, at least if I have this massive volume of memories, then I'm going to be happier and it's going to make me laugh and remember good times and all that. So that was my goal. I just wanted to make a podcast for myself, probably for my brother or my family, you know, my 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 um, my parents or my children. I don't know. Um, but we started making the episodes, and it was just literally recording our conversations and putting them completely raw in the podcast and of course my idea was oh i don't need to really edit anything because it's just for myself it's that i don't, I don't need to impress anybody uh but about a year ago um i guess it was part of my own selfishness i i believe everybody has some percentage of or, or just some uh, selfishness inside and I was like hey maybe I can really work on this on this podcast and make it cool and maybe share it with others and then you know uh, I might become famous and everybody would love my stories <laughs> um, or you know just make some money out of it why not and uh, so I started putting more effort on the episodes to make him sound more like uh, short audio movies or short um, audio, um, uh, what's the word? Huh. Yeah, you know, a little bit more professional. So I was still just making the conversations with my brother, but then... I was like, hey, actually, I want to put some music uh, and like a background music to make it more interesting, more taste or t tastier, if that makes sense. And since I already play some instruments, I decided to make our own music. So the whole idea to me was like, what, what if I can make these conversations more like little movies or audio movies, like I said, like audio documentaries where, you know, like I really work on this content and I really make it sound cool, like, like, you know, a, a really unique story. So, um, you know, that involves more time, more effort, uh, more work. Uh, we started, I started making the music. I started investing uh, more time on the, the production of these episodes. And 
even though it's not the coolest podcast ever, uh, I think we have accomplished uh, a lot uh, for this last year. Uh, eventually, I was thinking, why didn't I just like, you know, tell stories, stories I remember, things that happened to me, not just my the conversations with my brother, but, you know, <clears throat> sometimes simple things that happen to you and you just think they are amazing and you want to share them in a cool way. Why not making an episode, a short story about it? And then uh, I think at some point I was like, I should interview my mom and my dad and to have the audience, you know, for the future too. And then all of a sudden I was interviewing all their siblings and the stories became more like, I want to learn more about my family. I want to know what were their memories, what do they remember about their childhoods, uh, how was the world, you know, 50, 60 years ago, how do they remember? Simple things like, for example, I, I didn't really know that my mom, when she was born uh, or at the very first five, six years, no, probably like 10 years, uh, she lived in this little town where there was no electricity, there was no power, they didn't know what light was. Uh, and, you know, little things like this, uh, I just felt all of a sudden super hungry to, for, for this, you know, story that I never knew. And, that's why I'm here. That's why I am recording this video because I wanted to share this uh, podcast with you. Uh, once more, it's it. I wouldn't consider it a good, nice, perfect, uh, professional podcast. But you know, I'm, I'm trying to make my best, and I'm improving as always. As everything, you know, everything works like that, I guess. And I wanted to share it with you. Uh, the name of the podcast is Grabación. I know the name the, the name is dumb because like I said, I wasn't serious about it. Um, and uh, you can find it on Spotify. Uh, this is uh, this podcast is not meant to be uh, you know help for those who are learning Spanish. It's not a language learning podcast. But I think that you could find it interesting to keep yourself learning, uh, to help you find, uh, or, you know, sometimes even I use podcasts or I listen to podcasts that are not literally teaching English, but I just love them. And I would love to share those with you in another video. But yeah, I think the stories are cool and I'm gonna leave two links in the description of this video. The first one is for those who already have or use uh, Spotify or want to download Spotify right now because my podcast is super cool and you guys don't want to miss it. Um, so yeah, the, the first link is gonna take you directly to the app and you're gonna be able to listen to the last episode, I think. And the second link, it's gonna be for those who don't have or don't want to download the app but I still want to listen to the podcast. It, this link is for the Spotify website. Uh, and yeah, it's the same. I'm just gonna be listening to the podcast directly. Sorry guys, I think that my camera doesn't have any more memory. What happened? Yeah, there's no more memory. So now we are in a dark mode. <laughs> uh, I just wanted to say that and thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for, um, if you're still watching my videos anyway, uh, I'll, I'm trying to be more consistent with those uh, or with them. And please, if you have any comments, any corrections for my English, please let me know. Just write me a comment here. Uh, thank you and see you in the next one. Bye.